Hello and welcome to your cop news. I'm JD Eggert with a whole lot of stories today. We start with Royal Caribbean, who has just returned to the port of Labadee, Haiti, after a seventh month hiatus. Oh, wow. We're so happy to have Labadee back on itinerary since it's one of our favorite ports. Currently, all of Independence, Freedom, Oasis, Explorer, Voyager, Symphony, and Grandeur of the Seas will visit Labadee in the remainder of 2024. <coughs> Celebrity Cruises has announced it will be returning in early 2025. Royal has also just made some good news, bad news announcements. So let's start with the good. Uh, after the success of Perfect Day at Coco Cay, plans for Perfect Day Mexico have been unveiled. Located in Mahahual, Mexico, the new destination will service Western Caribbean itineraries. This, of course, also follows the Royal expansion in the area with Royal Beach Club Cozumel coming in 2026. <laughs> with an all-new water park, pools, beaches, restaurants, and bars, Perfect Day Mexico will have an unparalleled lineup of experiences and feature, quote, locally inspired twists across the design, flavors, and spirit, according to the company. Ooh. Now the uh, not-so-fun news here. Royal Caribbean is increasing the price in auto gratuities starting November 1st, 2024. Quote, the cruise line will raise a daily gratuity rate by 50 cents per day, bringing the new rate for standard cabins to $18.50 per person, up from $18, and suites to $21 per person, up from $20.50. It is the same amount for all passengers regardless of age. However, if you've already booked your sailing, you can prepay your gratuities in advance to lock in the current rate and save money. If you wait until you're on board and are cruising after November 1st, you will be subject to the higher fare. All Royal Caribbean sailings booked on or after November 1st, 2024 will automatically inf reflect excuse me, the increased rate. Yeehaw. <laughs> <laughs> now on to MSC, who have expanded their partnership with Guinness World Records in their entertainment department. If you've sailed on a seascape or World Europa in the last 18 months, you may have participated in any of the 30 world records set by the partnership. Over the next year, this feature will be available across all MSC's fleet. Let us know in the comments if you've broken any records on MSC that aren't casino losses. <laughs> oh. And now, finally, a permanent Bristol Hard Rock is set to open in Bristol, Virginia on November 14th. It will feature nearly 1,500 slot machines, over 50 table games, and a sports book, a 303-room hotel, and multiple dining options. The Hard Rock Live venue will seat more than 2,000 people. If you're in the area, let us know how you like it, and if you think they'd be a good UR Comp partner. Ooh. That's all for this week's UR Comp News. Applause. Nice, Gene. Yeah. Yeah. Well